Yo car, yo rag. You want the car. <laughs>Top of the AM YouTube is your boy back with another video. So this morning I got a little busy situation. What I'm getting ready to do this morning. Number one, I gotta put an alternator on the Lincoln. I went to uh the junkyard yesterday and tested a couple of them out, found one, but end up getting the wrong alternator. It went on, it bolts on, start the cars up. Uh it's also also working correctly, but I wasn't paying attention to how many wires that's on the alternator and the battery charging light stays on on the Lincoln. So I have to go find a three wire alternator. And also we're going to bring the grapevine back out. We're going to slide over to my man, Big Russ at Kingdom Customs. And uh, uh, we're going to go holler at him to get the tire fix on the Denali. Yeah. Oh, you see how these things looking? with the water on them. Look at that, still wet. So guys, I don't know if you see it, but we put that thing on the hood of this yesterday, or last night, you know what I'm saying? Maybe tomorrow or something like that, I'm gonna go ahead and finish the rest of the truck, get it done, get the headlights, and I also, also did the trunk of the Lincoln. Did the trunk of the Lincoln, buffed out the trunk of the Lincoln, and we're gonna do the whole the whole thing you know what i'm saying y'all stay tuned like oh yeah but y'all know what that is look at that yes sir y'all stay tuned like share subscribe let me move some cars around so i can get to my day and do what i gotta do and uh let's get it hey y'all see your boy man this i'm out here looking for a three prong three wire alternator I'm seeing two everywhere. I found one alternator that I can use, but it seized up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Definitely not a good situation as of right now. Definitely not a good situation. Stank your leggings, where y'all at? Man, ain't this some? Try the Crown Vic. Crown Vic got the same alternator, but it's a two prong. Man, man, man. Marquise is the same thing. 05 from 03 up changed the. They changed their plug settings on the alternators. So I can't use them. You know what I'm saying? But looking on here. I'm looking on here. Totally different situation. It's an older one. Older Lincoln. So we got the four six in there. Let me see what year this is. The body style changes. This is a 96. This definitely ain't gonna work. We need 2,000 or better. Oh, man, 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 man. Man. Man, 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 man. You know, when you get to the junkyards, a lot of them take the alternators off to put in the scrap pile. 
Can't use that one. That one's gone. The Mustang should have some of them. Nope. Totally different situation. This got a 3.8. He's either going to have a 3.8 or a 5.0. Y'all can see I took this one off. But the plug is completely different, guys. Completely different. And I'm not going to splice. I'm not going to splice no wires to make an alternator work. I can, but I'm not. I'm not going to do it. Uh, let's look under here. Y'all stay tuned, man. Let me. I'm on a hunt. So, guys, I found a donor on this one. I've been walking past this. Also came over here yesterday. It was seized up. So something told me to put my imaginary vice grips on there and unseized it. And this is a like a Grand Marquise. Yep. If it's if it's old one, the better. Oh, and it's an O3. We can use this, guys. We can definitely use this one. The plug's the same. Uh, that's the one we're going with. You see, I unfreed it. I unfreed it. And also, it is a three-prong. A three-prong. It's also a three-prong. So, we're definitely going to pull this one off. I got to pull all this stuff back. One thing about the junkyard, man, you get to take out your frustration on some stuff. And I'm going to break all this stuff off so I don't cut my hands. And uh, we're going to remove this alternator. And one, two, let's get it. So y'all see we got that thing off. Uh, now we're going to go up here and do the swap out situation. Three prong. You guys got to make sure you look out for that type of stuff when you're changing alternators to make sure you got the right amount of wires. I was in a hurry yesterday and I was not watching, nor was I paying attention. And uh, I seen that you know what I'm saying? So the alternator is still charging on the Lincoln, but it's not a three-prong alternator. It's not giving it what it needs. So you see this one? You got the three wires on there. So hopefully everything else the same. That's what we're going to go up front right now because I got the old one up there. As long as the plug is the same, the bolt-up situation is the same. We are all good, and y'all keep y'all fingers crossed for me. And uh, let's get it. All right, y'all. We got big tire in the back, big rim in the back. So we didn't got the alternator. I'm gonna go slap it on real, real fast to make sure it's all good. Cause I left something at home. Cause I might be pulling up on a certain somebody to doing the detail for them. So y'all stay tuned. Let's get it. Like, share, subscribe. Peace. All right, y'all. So I got the alternator on the Lincoln. That was the problem, guys. The charging light is off now. So. Uh, for future reference, for anybody, you know what I'm saying, that you, you trying to match up an alternator or whatever. Also, look at two things. Look at up how it bolts up to make sure that's correctly. And also make sure that the plug that goes in the back of the alternator, not the cable that runs from the from the battery to the alternator. Look at the look at the plug-in part, which I skipped being in a rush yesterday, and I didn't look at the two-prong and the three-prong wire. So took care of that we got a three prong wire alternator on there and the light came right off it's not on so we all good on that we got that taken care of so right now we finna slide on big russ at kingdom customs he can already look out for your boy one time for the one time you know what i'm saying so y'all make sure y'all stay tuned and like share subscribe for the rest of this video because uh and make sure you watch the whole video because it's going to be a lit situation that's going down but y'all stay tuned them clouds over there towards Joliet going towards Joliet man it's looking bad that's where I'm supposed to be kind of going for a detail man y'all look at that man y'all look at how them clouds is looking it's not looking good for your boy hopefully it is but we're gonna keep our fingers crossed let's get it so I also want to share this with y'all man I gotta I also got another son that I ain't introduced the channel to maybe one day uh you know what I'm saying he'll pull up on me but today, I'm rocking his uh, his merch. Y'all see it? I hate Jake. That's my son merch. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if he's still doing the shirts or whatever. But it's my son clothing line right here. You know what I'm saying? He out there doing this one team, man. He doing his thing out there. And uh, one day, he going to pull up on me. I'm going to introduce y'all to the channel. Let y'all see what he do. 
because he got another situation going on that y'all might want to check in on him. But uh, let's get to it. boy back with another video y'all know where i'm at home of the replicas you know what i'm saying so we right here at kingdom customs on 87 man i'm trying to find out what's going on down the street down there at that park because they got a bunch of barbecue grills out there i'm talking about barbecue grills on top of barbecue grills over there so on the way back back to the crib we're gonna spend by there and see what's going on over there but i'm gonna spin this camera around and let y'all see because we are in the home of the replicas make sure y'all like share subscribe you need a rim Y'all make sure y'all come down there and uh, holler at uh, Kingdom Customs on 87. Yes, sir. Man, y'all see what they got going on up in here, man. Let me take y'all to these. They got big replicas up in here, man. They always got the replicas on here. I'm going to see which new ones they got. You know what I'm saying? They got the snowflakes. I'm digging these right here. You know, Cadillac wheels right here. And they always got the Stratas on deck. You know, I love them. You know what I'm saying? With them big lips. Yeah, let's see if I see a new rim in here that I ain't seen in here. Oh boy, look at this. Yes, sir. Y'all see that? Big red. Yeah, big P on the cap. Y'all see that? Yeah, they got some joints up in here, man. They got a lot of stuff in stock, man. If y'all come pull up, this ain't no weight. You know what I'm saying? And right now, it's time to butt up, boat up, man. They got all these car shows going on. Go on and, you know what I'm saying, pimp your ride out, do something to it, custom, legendary, you know what I'm saying? Okay, I see these, I like them too. Yeah. Because in a minute, we're going to do a new twist on the Denali, man. I ain't sure what I'm going to do yet, but I got some in mind, uh, something, something that your boy for the turning into, uh, oh, big lips. Okay. Yeah, your boy's gonna turn the Denali up one more one more time for the one time. You know what I'm saying? Oh boy, I ain't been over here. Y'all see him? We in the Lexani wheels. Yeah. Yeah. We got big lips. What's up, boss man? I can't complain. Oh boy, big bands wheels. Y'all check this out. Big bands wheels. Y'all see them? Them is nice right there. I like that with the little chrome lip. And it's a one piece. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Yeah. Big bands wheel down there at the bottom, man. I like them too. Y'all see them? Mmm. Yeah, they got them joints in here, man. Yes, yeah, sir. Man, Big Russ about to take care of your boy, man. So Y'all need to tap in. Like I said, man, a lot of these places don't have no 28-inch tires on hand on stock ready to go. You know what I'm saying? For somebody just to pull up, get a tire, and pull it back off. But uh, Russ got them. You know what I'm saying? He got them ties. He got them ties for you. Yeah. We back at it. You know what I'm saying? We for the had a 103. The grape truck is fit to be back on as soon as we get back to the G. Thanks to my man. So y'all want to give a shout out to something where y'all at, man, where I can find you? Uh, find them at Kingdom Custom Wheels. Yes, sir. What's the address? <laughs> <laughs> I know it's on 87, but I don't know the number. We're going to get Russell. Come on over here, man. Yeah, yeah. My man's, no, nah, no, nah, ain't no none of that. They like you on the channel, man. Come. Y'all hear my man? Yeah, he over there hiding the day. Yeah, he over there hiding the day. He don't want to get on, but they definitely looked out for your boy, man. Y'all make sure y'all come in, man. Y'all need some, and I'm going to pull up with it. They knocked me out, and they had it in stock. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe. Y'all tap into them. They also are on Instagram, Kingdom Custom Wheels. Tap into them. Yes, sir. 
Yo, look, man, I got the legendary dude up here, boss man himself, man. I'm at right now the home of the uh, replicas right here at Kingdom Customs, man. I'm going to spin the camera around let my man tell y'all. Y'all stay tuned and y'all stay tuned and let's get it. Hey. Man, Russ at 2657 West 87th Street, Kingdom Custom Wheels. We waiting on you. God bless. Yes, sir. Yes. Oh, bitch, your boy back with another video, man. We finna get this thing crackalacking. We down here at the Steel City Car Club. And I'm, I'm waiting on the ride so I can go get the one team. I got one team parked over there. And I'm about to go get another one. And we for the pull up. You see, I got my man Johnny Lee in the building. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all subscribe to him. You know what I'm saying? We doing our shit together today. We trying to get it in. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe to the channel. And let's get it. Intro yes, there, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Oh, you want to get in on the channel? Go ahead. No, you got to shout, shout it out. Hey. Tell them your name and everything. You're going to be on YouTube today. Go hey, on, tell hey. them. My name's Cynthia. Come and shop. I'm Nicole. Come shop at the ride. He's on Grand Street and Gary. I'm the store manager. All right. Y'all heard it. So look, Johnny Lid out here working, and I'm trying to find a ride to get one ting. I got two times coming. I got my daughter coming, too. Ride, ride, pants on fire coming. Oh, and I see catfish coming. Maybe catfish should take me to go get it. I don't know. We for the sea. Yes, sir. Got catfish corner pulling up. I'm for the action. You know what I'm saying? You might do it for me. It ain't that far. You know what I'm saying? I'm riding the motherfucker back. Yeah. You got Uncle Catfish in the corner, but hold on before you go in. Uncle Catfish, can you give me a ride to go get the motorcycle? I guess. Yes, sir. Hey, we in the building. We in the building. Hey, look, me and Catfish about to go get the, we about to go get the hot rocket. Yeah. I knew I'd catch somebody out here. Yes, sir. First time riding on grill <laughs> with my Uncle Catfish. You know what I'm saying? Uncle Catfish about to go to the black women real quick, and we about to get the one team. We about to get the one thing and pull up. It's already wiped down. She ready. And you know what I'm saying? I might take my shirt off or something. I don't know. It's kind of hot. You know what I'm saying? We gonna pull up hot and ready. Yeah, yeah. Wifey in the truck. Yeah, oh boy. Y'all see them catfish corner. You know, we just keep it LA'd out, rated out. You know what I'm saying? But y'all stay tuned and also y'all subscribe to my Uncle Catfish, man. Uncle Catfish pull up in the Jeep. And old girl. Yes, sir. And let's get it.